Number 1. Hot Springs Hot Springs is a city in the Washita Mountains with a unique history and superb architecture. Settlers in the 1830s found that the waters of the springs had medicinal properties. In the late 19th and early 20th centuries, Hot Springs developed as a spa town favored by celebrities and even mobsters such as Al Capone and Lucky Luciano, who came to gamble at Oaklawn Park races and enjoy the waters. Number 2. Petit Jean State Park Petit Jean State Park lies in the north of the state just to the west of the town of Conway. The state park is said to take its name from a young French woman who lived in the 18th century in what was then Louisiana Territory. The story goes that her lover was to join an exploration of then unsettled land, so she disguised herself as a man and joined the expedition as Petit Jean, but died on the journey. The park is famed for the natural beauty of the scenery, there are huge cave formations, canyons, and the man-made Lake Bailey for boating and fishing trips. Number 3 Hemingway Pfeiffer Museum and Educational Center The Hemingway Pfeiffer Museum can be found in Piggott, not far from the Arkansas-Missouri state line, and was once the home to the Pfeiffer family, who owned about 60,000 acres, 24, 281 ha, in the area. In 1927, the great writer Ernest Hemingway married Pauline Pfeiffer in Paris and was known for making frequent trips to Piggott to write and relax until they divorced. A barn in the grounds of the Pfeiffer house was turned into a studio in which Hemingway penned much of a farewell to arms. Number 4. Blanchard Springs Caverns Blanchard Springs Caverns are an extraordinary natural phenomenon in northern Arkansas. The caverns are located within the Ozark St. Francis National Forest and are a major draw for visitors who can take advantage of guided tours through various chambers and rooms within the caverns. The caverns were only explored for the first time in the 1950s, though discoveries made here include a Native American skeleton that dates back over a thousand years. Number 5. Little Rock Central High School Little Rock Central High School is one of the most historic sites in the state of Arkansas. Today the high school is a national historic landmark and remains a working school, but back in 1957, it was the scene of a key event in the history of segregation and civil rights in the United States. Number 6 Crater of Diamonds The Crater of Diamonds is a unique attraction. It is the only diamond site in the United States where visitors can dig for treasures and keep anything they discover. The site, which covers 37.5 acres, 15 ha, was once the face of a volcano that brought diamonds to the surface of the earth over 100 million years ago. Number 7. Eureka Springs The entire city of Eureka Springs is listed on the National Register of Historic Places. The city was founded and grew as a resort town in the late 19th century and is still preserved as a record of architectural styles. Following the end of the Civil War in the 1860s, Eureka Springs was promoted as a resort for wealthy valetudinarians who would take the spring waters to cure a range of illnesses. Number 8. Arkansas Arts Center Located in the historic MacArthur Park area of Little Rock, the Arkansas Arts Center is one of the most important galleries and exhibition spaces in the state. Founded in 1960, the Arts Center built upon the collection at the Museum of Fine Arts in Little Rock. Winthrop Rockefeller was one of the driving forces behind the foundation of the center as a theater, gallery, and arts school. Number 9. Buffalo National River The Buffalo River was the first designated national river in the United States in 1972. It runs across the state for over 135 miles 217 kilometers, and in the lower stretches, the area around the river is managed by the National Park Service. Visitors have plenty of opportunities to explore the immense and sublime scenery through hiking, canoeing, and fishing expeditions. Huge rock formations, caverns and bluffs sit along the river as it meanders through the Ozark Mountains. Number 10. Little Rock River Market The river market area of Little Rock on the Arkansas River is one of the most vibrant and dynamic areas of the city. Since the 1990s, the area has seen large amounts of investment and is now full of libraries, residential developments, and markets. Over $300 million was poured into the project, which is centered around Ottenheimer Market Hall. Hope you like this video. For more videos, please subscribe to our channel.